Hi, my name is Patchy and I wanted to go over my project for the integration challenge. Um, I decided to try to integrate the AxiDraw pen plotter. Um, I thought it would be kind of funny to do real-time rendering with, uh, with actual physical pen and ink. Um, and I started with a uh, the AxiDraw actually provides a program in processing that lets us uh, do real-time AxiDraw drawing. And uh, for the challenge, I added OSC controls to the real-time example and um, basically would send out points of geometry from Touch Designer to, um, to this uh, real-time AxiDraw program. So, I'd start that up. We're listening in here and connected. Um, basically, I have a triangle that I have, am just rotating around and scaling. And whenever anybody um, sent uh, in the twi Twitch chat says the um, triangle command, the axi draw will actually draw the uh, triangle at whatever points it was at when it got called. So if we were to get a bunch of those commands, basically they're all going to be different sizes and rotated in. And um, so just try to trigger a bunch of them. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't get to any of the other commands. It took me a little too long to write the OSC bridge. Um, but we were able to get really cool designs anyway. Um, I can show you the pictures that were done um, during the actual competition. Did some black and silver. So that was my Twitch chat integration. Hi, my name is Patchy and I wanted to go over my project for the first challenge. Um, it was an interactive challenge and I decided to go with uh, this Guitar Hero controller and this toy synthesizer called the Blip Blocks. And actually this was my first time using either of these devices uh, with Touch Designer. Um, I just figured it would be fun. So uh, here, basically, I started with my Guitar Hero controller. I have, I'm able to get all the buttons, the whammy bar, the uh, strums, and the tilt. And I hooked a lot of those controls up to the 3D scene, and then also fed all these buttons out to the synthesizer as a MIDI device. So here I'm able to play notes. And I can still. And I got the strums for drums. And I can mess with the sounds as I want. And uh, I also can just have it generate its own sounds with the sequencer and still play with it. 